Uh, this is the Holocrafters S38E. Uh, the thing is old, really old. Uh, I think it came back into the late 40s. And uh, so it's, uh, it's, it's, in, it's, not, it's in my generation, you can say. Uh, it indicates where you, you know, certain locations where you can find uh, certain stations. And however, I feel that that may, just may, be inaccurate. Okay, although amateur ten meters might be accurate. Um, and what does it have up here? Amateur eighty meters. That's probably accurate. I don't think the aviation part is. And WWV might be accurate. And. Um, so there's a couple things in here. I have a feeling uh, Greenwich and Argentina and Brazil, that might not be accurate. So this is the, you're listening to the broadcast band. I'm going to move it up to the next band, which you probably won't hear anything on it because it's daytime. And daytime, you don't hear a lot on uh, 1.7 to 2. So I'll... Yeah, that's all you hear is noise. I don't hear anybody on there. Okay, not even, uh, yeah, you don't hear anything. So let's go to uh, band three. We might hear something. Okay. Uh, I don't think that's English. Oh, that is, uh, uh, what do you call that thing? Uh, FT8. I thought I heard it. I don't think that's FT8. That's CHU Canada. I don't know if the, uh, the frequency is accurate there. And, uh, I can, what I can't, what I have trouble understanding is this guy, it's, he he's there. He sits there 24 hours a day. I don't even know if he can even read a book because every minute he has to say something. He has to give he has to give the time. So it must get awfully tiring uh, sitting there every day, min, uh, every minute uh, giving the time. But that must be really difficult. I don't know what that is. That sounds like some kind of broadcast. That's ham radio, but it's sideband, and we really can't. We have a BFO, but it doesn't. You have to be able to control the the gain, and you can't. Oh, that's FT8, um, and that's a digital type mode that hams use, and. Uh, I will tell you that that I can usually decode that, although that one isn't that loud. Let me see. I can usually decode that. There's a guy from uh, of from Dayton. You know, the, this is the hamvention time. There's a guy from Dayton on there. Um, I don't see if there's any CW. Yeah, I can hear some CW in there, but that's, you can't really have, you don't have bands, well, you do have bands spread on it. I guess I could have bands. I have a feeling that's not local. There's some more FT8, and I don't know what it's doing down there. Okay, and we probably won't hear anything on band four because the, the day hasn't really woken up yet. Well, there's something there on band four. Oh, that's a, that guy has a little easier. This is WWV. 
Um, well, he's on every minute too now. Yeah, he's on there every minute. Uh, he sounds like he's an American, and he has to do this every minute. It must be really exhausting. To he, I, he's out in Colorado. Uh, how do they get? I don't know how much they how they get that much sleep. You know, in a minute, and then he's up again, and then if he eats, he's got a he's got a pause every minute uh, to to get some more food in his mouth. And it looks like the the, the frequency is a little off. Let me see if I can move the band spot. I don't know if it moves it up or down. Let's see. Yeah, the frequency is a little off. At least I lost. Where is WWV? Okay, I missed his announcement. Uh, hopefully, he doesn't he doesn't miss any announcements. But the the band spread the, it does the band spread does work, but the uh, frequencies of the frequency of the dial is a little bit off. I'm let's go back to number three. Okay, let's see if that guy is he he has to do two languages sometimes. He does French. And he does uh, English, uh, and this is this re uh, this is a uh, five tube uh, uh, receiver, and I I believe the filaments are wired in series, uh, so that's uh, uh, one tube goes out, they all go out. Christmas lights used to be. There he is. Okay, that's the English guy. So he speaks English. I think they alternate. They have two men sitting there, and you, one speaks French and one speaks English. And so uh, that's the Holocraft is ST8. I don't know if we can see the back here. Um, I really can't uh, get that very well. There we go, a little bit. Um, I know sometimes people like to ask for more pictures. Jesus Christ, how many pictures do you want? Um, anyway, that's uh, the Holocraptus S38E.